Hey guys, what's up? MacBoy here from MacBoy Productions and today I'm going to be doing a very quick video showing you how to scroll through your windows in any program. Meaning, um, there's the shortcut on your keyboard to scroll through applications like this, command tab on the keyboard, but there isn't a way to sc scroll, there isn't a keyboard shortcut that most of you haven't heard of to scroll through your windows of a certain application. For example, uh, text edit or Word, um, and I'm just going to give an example here. Say you have a bunch of uh, Word documents open, right? And you're working really, you know, con con there's a lot of content on your screen, and you can't you can't keep using Expose to keep switching through them. And you have some text edit files open, you have some internet files open, and it's just really really annoying. You can't keep looking for whatever you want to see, right? Um, I'm not going to give you the option for spaces because that's a totally different thing, but what I'm going to tell you is how to switch windows on a program. This is the keyboard shortcut and it's basically the same thing on just like switching applications. So switching applications is command T, say I'm in Word, hit command tilde or tilde, the, the keystroke, the asterisk above the tab key. Um, I still don't know what that's called. But from the comments, I've learned it's tilde or tilde, one of those. So hit command, that keystroke, and you will be switching through those windows. You know what? I actually found this by complete accident, and I thought I'd let you guys know because it really is a big, big time saver. Time saver, and uh, I thought I'd let you guys know. So here you go, guys. There you go. Let's go into text edit. Have all these files, documents, windows open. Switch through these, edit whatever you want to do. You know, this works with almost any program for what I have done. Like, I'm using Swift Publisher. I was working on about uh, like 10, 10 different uh, windows. And uh, I was pretty upset because I kept had to doing this, you know, the expose, and then finding the one I want to go to, and then clicking on that one. So I learned just command, tilde, and it works just like that. Thank you very much for watching. But wait, don't just leave yet. I want you guys to tell me if this actually worked for you in the comments below. And please, if it did work for you, don't forget to subscribe to the right of this video. So guys, let me know in the comments below what you think about this little keystroke that I found out. And for those who did know, uh, congrats to that because I never knew about this little keyboard shortcut. And for those who didn't know, uh, again, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe on this video and channel. And guys, to the right of this video in the description where you click more info, you will find my Twitter, which I guarantee you will love because I have one of the most, some of the most amazing tweets in the world. Um, not really, but go ahead and follow me there. I have a blog, which I'm telling you, if you're not, if you haven't bookmarked my blog, you are missing out on something very big. Visit that, bookmark it, and visit it, visit it every day, and I guarantee you will find some amazing posts. Check that out, and you will find my business email where you can contact me for any questions, concerns, comments, or suggestions. And guys, I know I will get a lot of requests for this nice cubic wallpaper, and if you guys want it, link is also in the description. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. This is MacBoy from MacBoy Productions, and I will see every single one of you next time on MacBoy Productions.